The weather system fueling these fires over the past few days has finally broken down and our firefighting teams tell me they can feel it. We anticipate cooler air and moisture coming in the next few days, which is really good news. Still, firefighters continue to work around the clock to save lives and property from destruction. Well over a million acres of land has burned, which is over 1,500 square miles. Right now, our air quality ranks the worst in the world due to these fires. Almost anywhere in the state, you can feel this right now. More than 40,000 Oregonians have been evacuated and approximately 500,000 Oregonians are currently in evacuation zones. I also implore all Oregonians to stay out of the fire zones right now. I know that rumors of looting are extremely alarming and that it's unsettling not to know whether your home is still standing. Let me assure you that we have the Oregon National Guard and our Oregon State Police monitoring the situation and preventing looting. There are early reports from, from our state police that there are dozens of missing persons related to the fires, specifically in Jackson, Lane, and Marion counties. We will keep you updated as we gather more information. Hey, thanks for watching. If you like this video, check out these other videos from USA Today to stay up to date with all the latest news.